Tevin Jenkins, welcome to the NFL. Tevin Jenkins working through a back injury to get himself right. Maybe take me behind the curtain a little bit. Boom, Jason Peters gets hurt. You're in there, and here we go. What's going through your mind? I was running in there. The first thing in my mind is, all right, you've been practicing for this. This is the moment. This is the time. And then if I'm right, you know, I'm over here too anxious. Like, I'm in, like, hot feet. Then first series, I was out there, got a false start. I was angry at myself. You know, I was just too anxious for the play, hyped up, you know, the Sunday night football. So, of course, anybody would be hyped for that. I mean, put yourself there. You've done it. Yeah, I, I have been there. You know, when I started playing, you get a moment's notice. Full start. Offense number 76. Just being on Sunday night football, just looking, just looking around, knowing that I even got to even have a snap during that game was just, like, big enough for me. How difficult was it for you to come to grips with that back injury when you're seeing your teammates out there, you got your rookie class out there, and then you needed the back surgery before the season? It's never an easy thing. It wasn't, it wasn't an easy thing to like decide to deal with. You know, we took extra steps, but I had to get over a mental block for myself. You know, it was a thing I couldn't control. I need to move on from the situation. This is what's best for me. And whenever I come back from surgery, push myself twice as hard than I was before to make up for the lost time. Did you feel pressure from your own self as the days kept clicking off on the calendar prior to having the surgery? I wanted to be uh, like the main guy. I wanted to be that guy. And, you know, I knew surgery was going to put me back a little bit. And that's one thing I never had to deal with ever in my life. And being able to have that at this like big moment in my life it was a, very hard on me. So I was pressuring myself to uh, get back in there as fast as I can, do many other different things to make sure I could start playing and practicing. And it just ended up going the other direction, which was surgery. The Chicago Bears select okay, Tevin the glasses, I'm sure, have always been a, a conversation. Every picture I've seen, every video. So are you a little bit of Clark Kent? In my hometown, I was known as the kid with goggles because I was like to every sporting event. If you know who I am, because I was the only kid in, the, in like the town wearing them. I was wearing glasses underneath my football helmet. And my father got so mad at me because I did that. My glasses kept on breaking. So we ended up actually going to rec specs. We did that because we couldn't afford contacts. When I got to college, I was surprised that it was even an option, and that was the first thing I definitely did because I just hated those goggles. Like, they were just shifting around, cutting off my peripheral vision. I think you want to be a tone setter. You're going to be around here a long time. You're going to play a long career in the National Football League. It's all about how can I push myself even harder than uh, what my expectations are? How can I prove myself to myself and let me think that I deserve to be here because I'm my world's hardest critic and that's what's made me gonna grow a lot more. Player Profile is brought to you by Advocate Healthcare.